what's up everybody just a quick random video of something i'm working on um that i find may be useful for some people uh so what the what the project is is i'm taking a milwaukee battery and i'm setting it up so that i can use 12 volt items like you would use in your car you know you could set it up many different ways this is the way i'm deciding to do it um and I'll put all the parts in the description, but I just ordered the adapter that somebody CNC'd that sends out to your negative and positive. And then I ordered this little DC to DC converter step down, which takes anywhere from 15 volts, 15 through 40 volts down to 12 volts 5 amps so let me show you this is an 18 volt battery when i test it it runs about 19 to 20 volts but with that step down converter you'll be able to see Twelve point three one, the battery's putting out through this converter. So it did step it down. Before I put that, it was it was reading nineteen nine, sometimes twenty. So, just a little quick way that you can, you know, give yourself power on the go. Without having to buy like some battery bank or something. You have your Milwaukee batteries. I have a whole bunch of them. That's probably my smallest battery. And I built this because I have a portable water pump for the back of my truck for when I go camping. Or sometimes even when I'm doing some side work. I have seven gallons worth of water in the back of my truck. And now I can just run my 12 volt pump off of Milwaukee batteries instead of having to run it off my truck. Um, but I can do either or that's why I put the cigarette lighter on So now I can plug the pump into the battery setup If I don't want to use the battery, I just unplug it and I can plug it into any car. I have a cigarette lighter adapter in the back of my truck so It gives you options you can plug in uh, chargers for cell phones tablets Anything pretty much that you would use in a car, but you don't want to exceed the rating of whatever DC to DC converter you use, which mine is five amps. But just a just a quick little video, you can see the finished product and it actually powering something in my next video. So stay tuned for that, and uh, thank you guys for watching.